It's hard sometimes to be a guy that's a big dreamer. If you're gonna be a big dreamer, you better also be very resilient. Because you're gonna get knocked down a lot and you're gonna shoot for the stars and fall well short of that often. You simply can't measure a Ryan Hall performance on the same rule or the same measuring stick as everybody else because that's just not who he is and it's not how he runs. He's ready to go more than ever, he said, but I'm never going to run fast at finale. I remember just having a conversation with him on the phone. He's like, I'm not sure if you really want it the same way anymore. <laughs> This was kind of an opportunity that he could kind of go out on a limb and hope that God would meet him there. Just being the honest guy that I am, I was like, well, I'm just going to put God down. And they didn't really like that. They are like, do you want to put down like a real person? And I was like, are you saying God isn't real? I wasn't timing like how fast I was going. I've actually kind of gotten away from that because I find that I've been a slave to the watch for a long time. I think Jack is the guy that I need to get me back to where we both know that I can get to. While well, he's taking the road less traveled, that's what you gotta do to go somewhere. To come out here and run something like that was an incredible confirmation of being on the right track. He's like, so you can go out that fast? Like, no American's ever gone out that fast. He's had in his career three or four, maybe five days when he's been better than Ryan Hall. Ryan, this is a perfect day, don't waste it. Now that I've been to the Olympics twice, I know what it takes. It takes falling down and getting up. Mm -hmm.